It's done, Corey. Little Jenny, Corey. You notice that? Uh, am I your only wife, Corey? Uh. All right, Sarah. My hair is awful today. <laughs> um, Sarah, where, where are you from originally? Where'd you grow up? Uh, um, Minnesota. What part? Um, mostly St. Paul. What was your What was your family like growing up? Um, well, kind of a small family. Um, we, um, uh, let's see, it was just, um, my mom and I, and, uh, uh, we, um, let's see, we, um, um, I, I went to high school and college and, um, I don't know, that's pretty much it. Um, I, we, I had my grandma around. How would you describe your childhood? Very good, happy, um, like um, playing and being creative. Mm -hmm. How old are you now? Uh, 44. You're 44. Yeah. Have you ever been diagnosed with uh, mental health issues or something like that? Um, no, um, no. I do have... Um, uh, degenerative disc. Um, In your back? Uh, it's just a um, physical disease that uh, um, affects the neck and the spine. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Drug use for you? Is, is, is that something you get into? Um, not usually. Um, I, I just um, sometimes um, have alcohol. So... Yeah, sometimes that. Al alcohol is your thing? Yeah. How long has that been going on? Uh, since, let's see, huh. probably around age 20. Yeah. And how much do you drink now? Mm, um, not, not too much. Um, I can't afford a lot. So, um, uh, not, not too much. <laughs> How do you make money? Um, through SSDI, um, uh, the, uh, um, for, um, because of the disc disease. Where are you, where are you staying now? Do you, do you have a roof over your head? Uh, yeah, yeah, I, I do. <laughs> so I, I stay with a roommate, um, and um, I'm hoping to get um, uh, my own uh, apartment soon. Um, it's more like a room, you know, not a real big apartment or anything. Mm -hmm. How long have you been down here? Um, uh, well, let's see, about a, a week, yeah. You've been on Skid Row just a week? Yeah, and I'm, I'm actually pregnant. Um, so um the um father of the child lives here and we um we have uh been trying to connect you know because um I, I i want him to have well he wants the baby uh and uh, it's his boy and uh so I, and i want him to take care of the baby is he living on the streets no he has a job? Uh, yes. Hmm. Is your mom still alive? Um, I am not sure. Um, as far as, I, I don't know. I'm not sure. Do you have children? Um, no. So this will be your first. Well, um, uh, I, I, I did have a baby with um, Matt Damon, of all people, um, <laughs> named Alexa. So, um, um, but I don't usually talk about that. Um, but I met him in Miami once. 
So he, he got me pregnant in Miami and then came to Minnesota and um, kind of like this one I'm having a pre baby with, um, he took the baby and yeah, raised her. So, but I, I don't usually talk about that because I don't, I don't ever see her. And I, I rarely see Matt Damon, but, but yeah, we do cross paths sometimes. Sarah, where did you meet Matt Damon? Um, let's see. Um, um, Miami is where uh, we met um, Matt Damon and I, and uh, it was um, there was a Popeyes, and I was walking by, and it was Christmas. So, uh, I just um, walk was walking by, and he he came out and he said Merry Christmas. So. Um, yeah. And I, I recognized his accent. So. And it led to a child. It, it that did, yeah. <laughs> um, yeah. Do you, do you have friends? Um, yeah, yeah. Uh, it, it's an interesting group of people, um, you know, of all face and, you know, all backgrounds. So, yeah. Do you have any regrets in your life? Anything you wish you had done differently? Uh, maybe um, um, learn more. Um, uh, uh, you know, as in, um, like, um, re re like, read more, learn more. Are there things you wanted to do with your life that you never got a chance to or, or just got derailed from? Uh, yeah. What'd you want to do? Um, uh, um, let's see, uh, maybe, uh, um, maybe, maybe singing. I don't know. <laughs> Emotionally, what do you what do you go through? Do you get depressed? Do you get angry? Do you get anxious? Do you get do you go through things like that? Um, no, mostly I'm uh, a happy go lucky person. Um, uh, um, I I I'm pretty easy going. Are there things you're worried about or things you're afraid of at this point in your life? Uh, mm, uh, something happening to, I, I don't know, to, it's hard to say it <laughs> to any of my friends. <laughs> yeah. you, have you been homeless for a while? Uh, um. Um, uh, no, actually, <laughs> no, yeah, I wouldn't, yeah, I wouldn't call it, yeah, yeah. no. What brought you to Los Angeles? Um, from Minnesota? Uh, uh, the father of the baby, uh, that's pretty much it, <laughs> and I, I don't like winters at, um, in Minnesota at all, I, it doesn't seem to be. The father is back east, uh, back in Minnesota? Yeah, it it just seems to bother you know. Uh, I don't know me. I just I just hate the cold. Mm -hmm. And you're sure there's no drug use, along yeah. with the alcohol. Uh, yeah, I'm sure. Sarah, what what would you say is the most important lesson you've learned? in your 44 years? Um, so take really good care of your friends. That's nice. All right, Sarah, thank you so much for sharing your story. I wish you and your new baby lots of luck. Oh, thank you. Yeah. <laughs>